You guys had one job, you had to catch the oars, but no, you let one of them grasp into the villain's hands. You ain't supposed to do that, man. Like, see, now here's the thing with this, and I know I sound like a beaten fucking record with this thing, but if that ending, and I know a lot of you guys can absolutely agree with that, if you saw this ending right now without knowing what was gonna happen, like about, let's say, six chapters ago, let's say a month ago that we knew that this was going to happen, then you would have way more than emotional impact when this chapter ended in, like, Academia. Now that we kind of got that little moaning part of the chapter out, let me just talk about all the positives right now. I, I still love the ending of the last chapter. Let's just crash right into them. Let's just fucking them. And we do get to see a little bit of the race ahead, like, from, like, the start when we see you get a little bit of Darby. Like, he was, like, there, like, kind of taunting the motherfuckers going, right then it's like dude that's a decoy it's like they were just making sure that you guys are all in check just trying to make sure none of you guys but that was kind of the whole point of raising it. it's like the whole real objective i had here was to take care of the kids anyway so i don't particularly give a fuck although you as we know from like what happened with todoroki and deku and the others like that they just came crashing into all the villains and well they wanted their own little party to get out of there although they did have a massive like kind of like teleport from what we know the guy that's in the bar he was trying to get bail all those guys out now and he's like Oh, I guess I gotta hide them out. And even those, like, they try to grab the oars, but it's like, those were decoys because the magician had him in his tongue all along. And then fucking Todoroki just punches the motherfucker. Like, he's trying to get out, but, like, he's trying to do all this shit. And, like, even with that, they, I, I'm so glad because I remember saying that in, like, last chapter. It's like, that laser motherfucker. It's like, you better sh fire a shot. He shoots the fire right in the guy's chin, right there. And he's like, yo. Grab the orbs, I showed her like all them, they're like grabbing the orbs right there. And Todoroki, oh man, why do you, what? the slip of the hand, man, the slip of the hand. Darby grabbed him, he's like, oops, we need that. He goes, bye bye, like that. And you get to say, oh, by the way, just to piss him off, do you mind releasing the limit? He's like, dude, my face just got fucked up by a laser, do you mind? Like that, he's literally there, like probably missing off his face at the moment. He's like, mate, I just got blasted i just got fucking whacked in the face of the laser you want me to use this shit all right <laughs> it's just like he's just all right like no 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 none of the sass none of the handle but it's like if that was me it's like i just got my nose blown up and my face you want me to undo the trick like that no 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 none of that stuff right now honestly i was like yo that's rude but it's just like that was even a little bit more disrespectful getting to see like barker go get pulled back by the neck like that and then you know you get to see deku say gotcha and gotcha and it's like yo stay but i kind of appreciate that barker go like he was just like he kind of came into it a bit rational he kind of knew what was happening he's like dude just stay back like shit this shit's gone a bit too nuts so there we go, it's like all like that he's been taken, Deck was pretty pissed about this whole situation, and well, we're gonna have to some time to recuperate because I know Deck will be like, I wanna go out there right now and try and get him, but it's like Deku, you're beaten up. You can't do it. I would appreciate it if I, I don't think they're going to do that. But they are going to obviously have a rescue squad trying to probably get back Bakugo. I would like it if it was like a bunch of them. Like, like say like it was like Yari Rozu and like Kala Vosho. Like uh, Todoroki and a bunch of them. Like, I really like it. It's like, uh, let's say four or five of them just go out there and just do it behind Deku's back. That would be kind of cool. Saying like, no, we went out again. Get him and like... They say like um, I don't know a razor head went to be with them as well. It's like yo, we gotta be on backup. This is like your guys on little mission. Or well, fuck it, even all my game, and that'd be kind of cool to see. Like they go into there and they try and get them straight out. Although definitely like with the whole thing, it's like I still keep to the theories that I think one of like Bakugo's relatives is like a villain or something. I think there's like some relation because why do they want to take him? Because like he's mo he's the most prone to actually go to be like a you know like a villain out of everyone else in the series. So I gotta say I really did enjoy this chapter. Albeit the whole thing is like, this would have been way more impactful. And that's the thing. It was really good. I really did like this. It would have been way more impactful though if they really didn't show what was already going to happen. And I'm kind of a little bit bugged about that still to this day. But I did enjoy this one. I am going to give this one a full out 8 out of 10. There wasn't too much to really say about the chapter per se. Apart from like just like the whole theory that we go on about the whole Bakugo thing. But I've kind of gone about like that beating that kind of dead horse as well. And also as well like you know it's a great chapter but it would have been high, really high. And I know 8 is still a high score for me. But it's like this chapter really would have been higher if it was just like you didn't share that part. But it's like apart from that Deku was blasted. I did like you know the guy with the laser he got his little redemption 
because I couldn't stand him. And I was like, you know what? He got he got blast in the face, and it's like Togaroki, my boy. Why you get grabbed down? I mean. Oh, well, you know, we got the Shadow Guy back. I, I like that a lot. Like, we got him back. So, that'd be kind of cool if there was, like, redemption saying, like, I fucked everything up. Let me go and get, like, that'd be great if you get, like, a whole squad of them going out there, like, trying to get back and go back. But that's probably where we're going to be going from, like, the next part of this arc, I imagine, well, once we kind of end this training session. But that's all for me. So, thank you much for watching. As always, I've been Sazwa Panda. And if you like this video and you love academia, then how about you like and subscribe to the channel because that greatly helps. And also, as well, if you like the content, it helps you as well. That's all for me, so I'll catch you guys and you Academia fans next time.